hey, hey. What's going on, everybody? Let's see. did have to go through a handful of these to get a uh, seed that didn't involve trips out to levels that neither one of us enjoys. This one should be relatively simple. We'll see. saying he was going to get a drink, so he'll be here in a little oh. bit. Oh, it's here. Hello? Hello. Hello. Yeah. I'm okay, dude. Oh, it's going all right. How about yourself? Hmm. I'm doing fine. I am starting to reek the benefits of a 300 square feet apartment. Oh, I believe it. <laughs> it's starting to look livable in here. And, um, yeah. We, well, we do not have a mattress yet, but we have a bed, which is nice. Okay. And, uh, yeah. So it's, it's, it's getting somewhere here. I'm, I'm, Starting to get stuff organized again, which is has been a lot of work. 
Oh, yeah. Oh. I read had a lot of work as well, but it's it's starting to settle in at a, at a normal pace again. And that's nice. Very good. Hmm. I had a lot of fun with Hand of Fate in the off time. Good yeah, game. I've, I've seen that as a... Uh... Once in a while, I've popped into Discord and I see you're playing that. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Glad to see you're enjoying it. Mm hmm. Ah. Yeah, I need to start getting into the pile of games that people got for me this year. Mm hmm. I read about that on Discord. Yeah. Got just... like two batches of games from your brother. It, it would have been closer together, but. I was signed out of Steam friends list and mm. I forgot to sign back in. Ah, <laughs> alright. Mm, alright. Uh, Astromere looks like that's gonna be a lot of fun. Mm. And River City Girls. Oh my god. <laughs> I remember seeing that like right around the time it came out. Mm -hmm. It's like this is probably the best follow-up to the old River City Ransom that there's been. That old NES game. So they they tried to do something with it. Like, tried to do something with that property a couple years before River City Girls, and it just didn't really work out that well. I remember, like, the online multiplayer was just absolute garbage. Mm. People just kept, like, getting lost. But anyways. I am Psyduck tonight. Black. Mm -hmm. Getting back to being Rocco. Alright. <laughs> we have the Red Cane, the Green Necklace, Lightning Bolt Coin, Hammer, mm -hmm. and the Flute. Yes. Alright. I am ready. Alright, three, two, one, go. Good luck. And we have a standard oh, opening. Oh, oh okay. I am not your real uncle. Damn. <laughs> oh. oh god. Oh, I need I mean to. <laughs> Apparently I need to bind the diagonals. Ah. Uh, uh huh. Uh input configuration. Left, up, right, left, okay. Oh, better. Not gonna play this game without diagonals. Right? Oh god, that does not look like a healthy guard. <laughs> Well, I also got into um, C sharp programming. Ooh. Want to do some, like, all right. So I want to do some indie game development on the side. What's going to come out of it, I don't know yet. But, you know, just getting into it, there's like a very nice framework for it that does a lot of the dumb stuff for you. And okay. like based on Microsoft XNA and um, Oh god, what is up with these enemies, dude? Um, <laughs> and today I programmed... Um, I thought that was cool because I managed to get it first try, like, scrolling text, as in, it's not like, text is not immediately on screen, but prints like character by character on screen okay. with different text speeds. Well, that was fun. Just playing okay. around with that. Imagine that's more complicated than it sounds. Um, why do we start with mass? Oh wait, I smash sword. I feel like it could have been more complicated, but whenever you get a feature first try, it's like, man, I'm so good. And that last four. As long as you implement the next feature. 
Oh, oh also, have you seen No Way Home by now? Not yet. The uh, the theaters have still been really swamped. Mm, all right. Well, I have seen it the day after we talked about it last time. Very good. And I gotta say, it was it was, it was everything I hoped for. <laughs> that's that's about it. I mean, as with <clears throat> as with most of these things, I do watch a bunch of the YouTube videos that come out about it. So I know, like, the major story points. Mm -hmm. I just don't know how they get from the major story points to the other major story points. Mm -hmm. Well, alright. So I'm just kind of missing little details here and there. But, like I said last time, even knowing like, spoilers about the movie, it mm -hmm. still makes me want to go see it. Oh, yeah. It's, it was great. It's like, like I, I wrote... still want to see how they pull this off. Yeah, like, I, I wrote about that on Discord. I'm not a clapping at screen person or noise in cinema person, but when, when, when Andrew Garfield first showed up, I was, like, the cinema cheering was justified. Like, that was, that was an epic moment. And there were, ah, oh, there were so many good, like, small things, especially with, like, the interaction between all three Spider-Men was, mm -hmm. oh, so good. They, they, they really couldn't have done that any better. There was just, like, a very, very heavy amount of, like, meta communication and, like, like, free Spider-Man talking about how their powers work and, like, references to, like, the franchises and, like, two sp when, like, Tom Holland and Tobey Maguire tell Andrew Garfield, like, oh no, man, you are amazing. That's just... Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's just so good. <sighs> <laughs> I, I definitely think this is my favorite of the three new Spider-Man. And that's saying something, because the last one was mm. something special. That was a Lionel, walked right into me, and killed me instantly. Yeah, I'm, I'm on my first death just now. Yep, that was a thing there. Yeah, well, in my opinion, the, the Tom Holland Spider-Man movies only got better. Mm -hmm. And they started, like, up there, for sure. I just remember seeing something on <clears throat> Twitter not that long ago. It's like someone was saying, you know, oh, you don't need to make a new origin movie for Spider-Man. Everybody knows how it goes. <laughs> and then the response from the MCU is, okay, what if we make it three movies? <laughs> and, well, <laughs> we, we apparently went for it. I also like how they kind of made the other five Spider-Man movies part of the MCU just through the multiverse. Like, those are now MCU movies, just by canon. Oh yeah. I, I love that. It's just... we had to break the universe in order to do it. Yeah. So, oh my fucking god, how are you supposed to get through that hallway, man? Yeah, I'm... Am I supposed to throw bombs at that shit? Ah, uh, having question marks myself. Also, just casually dropping the entire Doctor Strange to Trader as the post-credit scene. Mm-hmm. Good stuff. I was not pre like I was prepared for a teaser. I didn't like when that thing just kept going and going. I was like, okay, just show us the whole trailer then. I'm very interested to see how that movie pans out. Mm. Same, same. And also... Oh god, uh, there's multiple. Ugh. Oh 
Get out, get out, get out! Oh my god, I did it. I did. <laughs> so there was an interesting technicality that mm -hmm. I hadn't thought of. Yeah. Um, in Marvel Universe. So, Doctor Strange got snapped. We, mm -hmm. we know this. Oh, that he's no longer the Sorcerer Supreme. Yeah, he's, he's yeah. not the Sorcerer Supreme anymore. Wong is. That was... So that puts Agatha Harkness's quote from the Darkhold almost into new perspective. It's like, well... Either Strange isn't as strong oh, as we thought, or that just means that she's stronger than Wong. Oh my god. This whole... Yeah, no, I get what you're saying, but... Oh. I mean, you could then, you could take it like that, or you could take it the way I'm sure they meant it to be taken. Yeah, I think the I think it's just you're stronger than better. you're. It's more of like the title than the person. Oh shit! I mean, well, thank God for how, sword lasers. How is someone like Agatha supposed to know about like the internal politics of you know the Kamatash? I feel like Vong becoming Sorcerer Supreme after the show that Doctor Strange put up, or, well, before the show that Doctor Strange put up in the fight against Thanos doesn't... I don't know. I feel like that's not something that's, like, publicly discussed. Yeah. There's an interesting like, connection that I tried to make, but still. Right. <laughs> okay, I finally made it through that hallway, somehow. Ugh. That was... I hope that's the hard part. <laughs> I mean, that was one of the hardest enemy rando things I ever had to do. It's always like one of those rooms in the escape. They just like make it overly difficult. That's a buzz blob. <laughs> Damn it. Still do something that way. Oh my god, that's okay. That is okay. That is okay. Well, one of the other things I've been catching videos on YouTube of is the uh, reviews of that new Star Wars show, The Book of Boba Fett. I've not... I've seen like one Reddit post about that, and it was like an image or something. I have not really gotten any it's... news about that. <laughs> it's interesting just because they're... Well, I mean, they're they're following Boba Fett after what happens in uh, Return of the Jedi, so it's kind of interesting because people have often wondered. Hmm. I'm done with escape. Very good, DG. Thank you. I feel like this game was not made to be played on the 2K monitor. <laughs> maybe. Maybe, they, just maybe they didn't have that in mind. I was actually just noticing that when I set up, I was like, where's my, where's my USB controller? Like, my USB SNES controller, why, why have I not set that up? How did I do that before I moved? And I was like, <laughs> oh right, there's this giant ass TV next to me. You just didn't set up your SNES yet. I'm like, okay, <laughs> right, there was something. Right. <laughs> Wait, what, 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 what's the goal anyway? Uh, Master Sword. Master Sword, okay. Right, there's no Dovito counter. Oh my god. Back from that. Okay. Let's waste some money.
Mmm. Mmm. That's some starting gear right there. Tempered sword and boots. Yeah, Kakariko's got some good stuff. Apparently. And a lot of money, holy crap. Just nope. a casual, well, more than 1k just laying around there in the basement. What the? <laughs> Giant fire snake hiding in a bush. <laughs> Ooh, hey, take that. Alright, don't hit that bush. One of the more terrifying things to have pop out of a bush. Is a fire snake? Yeah. Yeah. Though I think you could say that about any kind of snake. Maybe not in this game, but like in, in real life. Yeah. Don't want to have snakes just jumping out of bushes at you. <laughs> Doesn't necessarily have to be on fire. It's true. The on fire part is just like the extra I see danger. The cake. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> small magic drops that are suddenly in this. I needed to put something in besides nothing. Mm. It's just to have something else besides nothing. Right. I can't really do single arrows to the rupee bow. Yeah, that's fair. I could also just not do rupee bow. Hey, there's the fire snake. <laughs> Surprise! Yo! Moon Pearl and Monkey. 
I think we opened those chests at the exact same time. <laughs> hmm. oh, no. I thought I would Run. go for it when you said, what do we got here? Just hoping that maybe we'd be in the same spot. <laughs> right. Glad it paid off. Oh god. Eyeball statue. <clears throat> okay. Uh, one more back to Who put an eyeball statue right there? Oh my god. You people are the worst. <laughs> uh. I feel that. I feel that. <laughs> I just robbed him of his life savings. Oh, there's more than enough life savings in this country. <laughs> I have a book. I do have a book. Well, we'll see how this goes. Oh great, what's this thing? It's a thief. The sprite is not cooperating. <laughs> Unique item is in the hype cave. Thank you, spoiler tile. I just also found a spoiler about a unique item. Which is hidden behind the green pendant. Hey God. Yo, what's up, Robert? There's supposed to be an enemy in this room. Where is he? <laughs> this is freaking me out. Could have been a sand man. I just didn't go to the right part of the room to activate him. 
I also don't have gloves, so I can't finish the dungeon. Leaves these statues sitting on the damn bridge. Good I news will... is this seat has perfect agony. Oof. What was that? This seat has perfect agony, RNG. Well, almost perfect. Huh. Only one lightning. That's what you like to see. Oh, for fuck's sake. Spoiler tile. Porter magic is in per- uh... In what? <laughs> let's, let's try that again. Said quarter magic is in turtle rock. Nice. I don't know why a P sound came out. So I guess we're never gonna get that. Never gonna get quarter Dang, dude. I like half magic. And half magic is still on the table, but isn't you? Isn't it usually one or the other? Um, you can have them both. I don't know if I've found both in one seed before. Oh, 
serve me. Huh. Do I want to fight this boss? I'm, I don't know about you, but I'm at five hearts. I don't want to fight any boss right now. I, a wizard, I, guess. I guess I'm just killing myself. Ow, what the? Why do people just keep leaving statues in stupid places? The eyeball statues in the seat are atrocious. Uh huh. When you when you mentioned the them the first time, I was just running around outside of the Hyrule courtyard, and I was thinking, damn, he's he's right there with me. <laughs> but apparently, there are more. Oh yeah. That's what we get if we don't want to have a seed where we have to go through Misery Mire and Ice Palace. That, that was one of the ones that popped up when I was trying to get this. <laughs> Thank you for your service. Mm -hmm. It's the good thing. I'd like to think I have a stronger memory of the seeds I don't pick. <laughs> not the enemy that I want to see in this room. <laughs> Since I don't remember my way through the damn maze. Okay, here we go. Somebody back here dropped a key. I didn't pick it up. This is back to life. Yep, there it is. Okay. <laughs> Boiler tile. Unique item requires a green pendant. You're welcome. Thank you.
Finally. Hammer. Ow. Hammer is a really nice thing to find as soon as you get into Dark World. Yes. Yes, it is. Oh my god, I can navigate this map now. Oh, I found a bee. Nice. And I hit a dead rock, and I can't get through this path that's clearly big enough for me to get through. <laughs> dead rock disagrees. Oh, and I accidentally took it out on that poor fish. I didn't mean to. I'm sorry. Dang, man. I can sandwich. I threw the fish and he got stuck in the side of a wall. <laughs> Poor little guy. Mm. Oh, what do I get from this thing? Probably nothing good. Why is there a giant spike trap hiding inside a bush outside of my house? Hmm. The spike trap that's like four times the size of the bush. Someone... Someone's not very good at sending subtle messages. Mm-hmm. Oh my god, there was a buzz blob in that bush! Oh my god. 
still shocks you even after you hit him with the magic powder, I forgot. This is the worst placement for Buzz Blob, too. Oh, and I don't have gloves, damn it. That was. Final, please. stuff and that's not the stuff I wanted. I'll take it anyways. Oh yeah. Half of an eyeball man.
Or have it push me down the stairs, either way. Spoiler tile? Our container is in the dark. Hmm. Oh my Buzz god. Block. What is boss number one gonna be? Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Somehow. Get the chest. Oh my god. No! Oh wait, I, I have oh. the item. In here. You know, normally when you see fairies floating in a pool of water, floating above a pool of water. It's a nice image. Mm -hmm. Not when the water is red, though. Well, that's nightmare stuff. That's a slightly different connotation to it. These, yep. these fairies are up to something. Out 
it here. Yo, that is that is a new time for sure. There's the big key. Well, go get the thing then. The enemies are still dead. Hooray. Ow, bird. That's not much. Oh, Jesus. I really don't want to fight you, man. Oh, wait, this is vanilla? Okay. Not running all over this dumb room trying to find those stupid things. I don't have a bow! Yes. Ah, what else can I do? 
I know where I can go. Uh... Just saving for it. Yo, it's a thing! And I'm back to full health. Nice. I found a Zazak and a bee in the same bush. Maybe the bee Zazic? was in a bit of the tall grass. Uh, you know those blue and red fireball spitting enemies that are in uh, Thieves Town? In vanilla. Kind of look like horses. Mm, yes. Yeah, they are... <clears throat> I think the I think their name is Zazak. Z A Z A K. Like the Japanese name is like Zazaku or something like that. Of course. way. Oh, not you again, dude. Isn't it enough that I have to do you once?
Ow, just let me leave. Uh, oh my god. Cleared. BG. BG. Spam those emotes in Wild's chat. Okay. Does that guy still exist? <laughs> Fair question. Now. Last stream four days ago. Okay. Seems to be living enough. Mm-hmm. Got a double hit on that one worm. Sorry, what? Yo, red stick. Uh, the conveyor belt is still moving, even though the floor isn't. <laughs> I didn't need to get that crystal, what am I doing? It's a fucking crystal. You got gloves? Got gloves. Have you done your pendant dungeons already? Well, I can't finish uh, Dark Palace because I need a bow. Right, but have you done. Uh... I didn't go back to do Desert yet because I didn't okay. have a glove. Now I do. Mm -hmm. I should probably go back and do that. Giant Spike! Please. A god awful place. For I want to see what's here. Of course. Your uncle is rich. Ow. Use the lag to your advantage.
Man, if it's in that one chest, I'm gonna be really mad. the boss could still drink it. But I need to kill this guy. It doesn't matter. Ow. <laughs> Gotta love the way this game handles depth perception. <laughs> Which is not at all. Yeah. giant bomb that this monster threw that's way high up in the air? Nope, that hit you. Mm -hmm. I mean, explosions are free, free dimensional, to be fair. Oh, these giant boulders that are traveling six feet above your head. Nope, you got hit. Mm -hmm. Good old cannon soldier. You don't see him enough in this game. He's a good guy. I wonder how his cannon shoots those spiky cannonballs. What do you mean how? I mean... It's not how guns work. Not with that as you. <laughs> oh, but I had my sword out. I'll get bullied. Okay. Need to go turn this in. They moved those statues. They replaced it with Patrick Starr. No, this is Patrick. <laughs> <laughs> now. You haven't yet? Well, I just now found the bow. Oh, you can buy the arrow before that. Oh yeah, but I figured I'd find the bow at some point. <laughs> Foolish me.
Ow. No, I just want to shop. Fuck. So now the long, arduous journey back to where I once was. Trees are very purple. Okay. These fools alive. Get me. Finally. And burn all of you alive. I'm going to see a pattern here listening to you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Great way to play video games. Burning everything alive? Well, at least this and Mystic Quest, it seems to really work out in my favor. Yeah, how... What was the last time you speedran that? Oh, the wasn't last there time some, I like, speedran it? Oh god. It wasn't there like some weekly race going on at some point that you did? Yeah, there was. I don't know whatever happened to it. <laughs> like, did I showed up like one Monday and there was just no one else there. Like, oh, Dang. well... <laughs> Dude, it's bad, man. I guess it's not as serious as the Super Metroid race. I wouldn't mind doing another run of that game, except for the fact that it's a three hour long speedrun. <laughs> 
I was a, very surprised when I saw you speedrunning that. That's a major RNG component, like, near the end of the game, too. Mm -hmm. Well, I mean, it's always been a favorite of mine, but once I learned the, uh, the tricks, as it were, then I figured, oh, well, I've got to give this a shot now. Mm -hmm. Even the whole thing where you have your character powered up, or um, your, your partner character. Mm-hmm. Even that just helps so much in a casual playthrough. And then item duping, forget about it, that changes the way you play the game. Like, you don't use the attack button ever after that. You just always cast in magic. It's fair. I shouldn't have gone this way. Need to not be in Dark World. Probably also should have already done this dungeon now, but neither here nor there. It's playing. What the hell button is it to open up this damn save and quit menu? I can never remember. I press every other button first. That's the same for me with the map button. Never ever pressing that first try. Mm -hmm. Like, I haven't played this game a million times. Monk. Oh, by the way, the, um, the Yeti.com has a really cool, I'm assuming Metroid Dread t-shirt design. It's based off of the way that Samus' suit looks. Mm -hmm. And there's a, uh, a Legend of Zelda shirt there as well. It's kind of cool. Let me have a look at it. If I didn't already have a million t-shirts <laughs> specifically from the yeti.com. I feel like I gotta get you some sponsoring at some point. Are there two of these things stacked on top of each other? No, they're just flickering really fucking badly? Okay. A lot of sprites in this room. I think that pumpkin stole a bomb from me after his tongue was already back in his mouth. That's a very out of context sentence. stole a ruby from me, but I think it's just like if you get close to them, even when their mouth is open at all, they can still steal stuff from you. I don't need to do the rest of this dungeon, who the hell's here? Oh, for fuck's sake, it's you again! Yeah, that, that's exactly my train of thought. <laughs>
At least we got early bomb boss. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm still gonna die. Wait, I have a fairy in a bottle. As soon as I died. And they were both really close to dead, too. And that's the other necklace. Okay, let's go beat a video game. fish with me between worlds a fish between worlds a sequel that no one will ever give us mm. not unless we do it ourselves mm. open up zelda classic real quick <laughs> <laughs> ah there it is gg gg Emotes. I don't know which emotes, so I won't. Alright, it needs to be a little more specific than that. Oh, there's an in game fast forward button for the credits? Oh. Well, not the credits, but like the snapshots as we're going around Hyrule looking at stuff. Mm -hmm. Impressive. Uh, Why? Xbox 360 controller. Triangle, top face button. Yeah, I got you. Yeah, it's giving me a little bit of a fast forward. Well, but if only the scenes are speed up, the sped up and not the rest of what what does that do? Like, it's just... It's just speeding stuff up. Like, it... It looks like the character actions aren't sped up, but, like, the amount of time that the camera is spending here is sped mm -hmm. up. It's like the old man on the bridge didn't get to the middle to stop and wave. Mm. Now, does it work during the actual credits? It does. Mm. Hold on, do I have Joy to Key open or something? <laughs> <laughs> I do not. Okay. Huh. There's just an, sure. an in ROM fast forward button. That's pretty cool. I hope that's been there this whole time, and I'm only just now finding out about it. I have to go back in time to some of my old, uh... Some of my old ROMs that have the custom music. I don't Ooh. know whatever happened, and why my custom music just, like, stopped working. I wasn't Dude. doing anything different. I just remember that Chrono Trigger MSU being pretty neat. Mm hmm I just, I want to go and do that again, but with versions of those songs that are like a half hour long. Mm hmm So there's no, um, there's no like fading out to silence. Right. But that even be supported though? Like in terms of file size? I'm not 
sure if file size matters. So I was able to get that one... Well, I, mean, I was able to get that one song on, but that was you know, a couple minutes. Not 30. Mm -hmm. And not for all the songs. <laughs> right. I don't know. I need to try it again just to see if it'll work. Right. And then once I cross that bridge, then I can worry about the other stuff. Once I burn that bridge, I can worry about the other stuff. <laughs> burn it alive. <laughs> Never found you said it. Never found Hookshot. Yeah, where yeah. was all this good stuff? I don't know. You tell me. I have a link on copy pasta, so let's head over here. Hookshot. It was in Tower of Hera. Huh. As well as some progressive gloves. Huh. It wouldn't have been a bad version, but you know, we need it. Oh, some flippers. Those were in Misery Mire. Of course. <laughs> Else was I missing? All the flutes. What? Okay, so dark world. The mire shed. That's unobtainable. You need flute to get to mire shed. Mm -hmm. Logic being lazy just because we're not needing it. makes me wonder what's in big chest of swamp palace oh progressive shield i thought it was going to be the big key that's like one of my favorite ways for logic to kind of go back in on itself it was anything important in ganon's tower the single rupee drop mm -hmm. Everything else's keys are 300 rupees. What did I miss in Thieves Town? Nothing. Some money. Good. Oh my god, Turtle Rock had half magic and quarter magic. Wow. What jerks. And Ice Palace had the other, I guess, had Silver Arrows. Mmm. Okay. See any of the other stuff? Special. I was looking to see if I could find what some of the, uh, like, what the drop table was. Mm -hmm. well, Alright. That was, was some good fun. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> no, I like this one. <sighs> yeah, this was pretty straightforward. Uh -huh. Um, you mentioned something about having days off next week. Yes, I did. Let me see that again. Um, uh, do you want to do... Uh, uh, wait, Sunday the 9th, that's tomorrow. Uh, do you want to do something on Tuesday the 11th? Yeah. All right. figure something out for them. Okay, sure. Let's do Tuesday and Friday then. All right. Well, good luck for the race, dude. Thank you very I'm much. I'm going to be heading for bed now. All right. Uh, you have a good one, dude. All right. You have a good night as well. What clock?